Ange, the job was done by half time tonight, but how do you assess the 90 minutes plus? Yeah, no, I thought, um, again, another strong performance. Um, as you said, we, we started the game really well and uh, controlled it and, you know, got our goals. And, you know, I thought, yeah, you know, again, we controlled in the second half. Obviously, we didn't get the goals, but, you know, um, you know they still sat back even at 3-0, so it was hard for us to sort of get the space we needed, but even then, you know, we still had some chances. In that first period, uh, possession-wise, it must have been 80% plus. But how impressed were you with the, the persistence and tempo that the team played out to get the breakthrough? Yeah, no, that was the key for us. Um, you know, we kind of knew the kind of the way the game was going to go. We just had to maintain our, you know, composure, but at the same time, not sort of let them get comfortable and consistently try and you know, probe, <coughs> find ways through. And I thought we did that. You know, we constantly asked questions with our possession. It wasn't just keeping the ball, and um, you know, we got rewards for that. Craig Taylor's had a fantastic season, um, man of the match tonight. A, a very, very important opening goal. Yeah, it was. Yeah, no, he's um, yeah, he's been he's been fantastic this year, and yeah, you know, he's continuing to improve, continuing to learn, and um, you know, he's uh, he gets into these good areas, and you know, he can finish, which uh, it helps us because in a game like today, you know, you know, obviously the opposition will try and sort of negate our obvious uh, threats and. Um, I think the beauty of it is, again, we're sharing the goals around and uh, it's not just our attacking players, but everyone's contributing. And Dyson Maeda has a, a nice knack of being in the right place at the right time, but, but that's no accident, that's the determination these guys have. No, exactly right, yeah, he's always in the right areas, you know, and uh, he was tonight, you know, he just, uh, probably a couple of other times, just you know, lacked a little bit of composure in that front third because he continually gets and, you know, he's a constant menace if, if you're picking him up, um, he's always going to be making those runs, he's always going to be in the areas he's supposed to be and that's why he gets his goals. Composure is a word I could use for Kyogo, um, always confident he was going to score when he got that opportunity? Yeah, I thought he was he was great tonight. He really made some great runs. And um, again, when, when you've got a team that sits so deep, you need somebody who can break the line. And uh, he did it consistently. And, you know, every time we found him, he was a threat. But like you said, he took his goal really well and, uh, you know, continues his goal-scoring form. Perhaps took a breath when Callum McGregor goes down. He doesn't go down lightly. And, and I know you took him off late in the game. Is that just precautionary at this stage? Yeah, just got a whack on the nose. And, um, you know, he's fine. And... Um, yeah, it was a good time to, to sort of give Tomoki a bit of a run and um, obviously uh, get some, a few more minutes. So if we can get some minutes into these guys who have just come in, they'll help us um, down the stretch. Thanks for that, Andrew. Well done. Thanks,